gorgeous! So I have another braid tutorial for you guys, and I love braids. And this style I actually wore on my Instagram, which you can see over here. And it was a unanimous yes that you guys wanted to see a tutorial, so that is what I'm doing for you. And if you want to see how to get this look, it's really quick and easy, and it's perfect for any time. So just keep on watching. Okay, so what I'm going to do is start with parting my hair all the way down the middle. I parted it even in the back. I don't know if you could see that. And then I'm just clipping it off because all I'm going to do is braid this side. If you can do a regular French braid, you can definitely do this style. It's super easy. So I'm just going to take my top, divide it into threes like usual. So one stitch, pull over, add into it. But I'm going to kind of braid back. Cross over and then I'm going to feed into it from the front. So now I don't have any more to grab on this side, so it's going to kind of turn into a lace braid and that I'm not going to be pulling from this side, only from the back, to so cross over and still feed into the back with whatever hair you've got back there. You can't really see, it might be a little bit sloppier than normal because I'm turning away from my mirror right now. So do a couple more stitches feeding into and then we're going to braid back. Okay, so there we go. And then I'm just going to finish off my braid. Braiding back away from my face. Harder to break when you can't see what you're doing. Okay. Okay, so I'm just going to tie it off but give myself some extra space because I'm going to loosen it up and make it kind of a sloppy loose braid. Pull it down. And then start at the top and just pull out your braid, kind of loosen it up. You can make this as loose or as tight as you want. I personally like the more loose style. I think it looks more undone and more, I don't know, fun. So I've got my two braids done. I'm going to turn around and show you guys how I will pin it up. It's not going to look exactly perfect because I don't have a mirror to work with back there, but I'm gonna show you, give you the, sort of the idea of it. So this is the final look. I think it's super cute and it's great for any occasion. It's really easy to pin back. Mine's a little bit poopier than I typically like right now, or you don't have to leave the little hangies out. I did. If you guys like this and you wanna see more hair tutorials for me or braid tutorials for me, make sure to give me a thumbs up and leave your request in the comment section below. Don't forget to share this video with your friends and you better be subscribed to my YouTube channel. Visit me over at AngelaLanter.com for more really, really cool, fun stuff. And, you know, follow me on Twitter, Facebook, all that fun stuff. Thanks so much for watching, guys. Love ya. Au revoir.